Okay, how many have how many have seen the band have been to Snowball before? And there's so many people here. Everybody's experienced the same thing, and that's what Snowball is about: the bonding and the healing and the camaraderie that happens when you meet each other, right? Our Snowball Express program has a big annual event at Disney World every year, and because of COVID, we had to cancel it the last two years. And so the kids here missed out on those two years, and so we brought them here to Nashville to give them that one last big trip and have some fun and meet new people. Snowball Express has brought all of our graduates to honor their fallen hero, to make new memories, and to connect with other Snowball Express families. We've been going to Snowball since 2006. I've been going to Snowball since 2011, so this is about 11 years now. This is my second event with Snowball. The first one I went to was in 2019. We want to make this fun, we want to make this engaging, so we have a scavenger hunt for this event. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Just really exploring and just getting lost for the fun of it. And there we go. I'm in third place right now. I'm 66. <laughs> the Graduate Lounge is great because it really is kind of their scene and they get into it from TikTok dancing to decorating hats to carnival games. So it's got something for everybody. Mitchell came, they did hair, they did makeup, they did hand massages. We're just here loving on everyone, making everybody feel beautiful. This whole experience is honestly just like overwhelming but in a good way. I love it. How many of y'all like to cook? We had our very own Jim Ravella teach a cooking class of what they could do on just a hot plate. I'm not a chef, but I do love to cook. So I'm going to give a little lesson on easy ways to cook and preparing simple things that they don't take a lot of money. See what you think of that. Let's give it up for our champion. I saw what the other graduates did in 2019. My brother was one of them, and I was stoked. I was waiting for my turn, and then everything happened, and I missed out completely. It was so nice to finally be able to do a one last snowball event and not just have it called quits. So while we have a lot to offer the graduates in their lounge, the surviving spouses and guardians get to enjoy the adult lounge. And it's really designed to set people up to talk and connect and laugh. It's so important and it creates a family right away. In the daytime, it's more crafts and hands-on. They got to do cookie making and there were cups and mugs that they were making. but. At some point, there's always time for karaoke. <laughs> we wanted to give them the opportunity to leave the lounges and head over to Soundwave, which was a giant water park here at Opryland. Gary said it was something they could not miss. That was for you, Gary. Much love. This weekend is about celebration. This weekend is about these graduates going out into the world and giving them the best chance we can and just saying we're thankful for them and their families. Hi guys! He's such a giving, loving heart and there's just nobody like him. One of the things that we have that's really important is our resource room. We have things like military ID, financial planning services, scholarship information. I know that there's a lot of options and a lot of different nonprofits that'll help and I don't know a lot of them, so it was great to come in here and I learned a lot. We don't exactly know what we're doing and for them to be able to have you sign up right here, it's just helpful. Snowball is about making memories, getting together, having friendships, but it's also very much about remembrance. The Patriot Guard Riders work really hard to make this flag garden happen. And what's important to many of our families is the Patriot Guard Riders were the silent supporters. There's 241 flags at this event, all representing the fallen hero. All these flags are talking to you. It's just a very humble place to be. A lot of these families have been watching Gary and the band for 12, 13 years, and so Gary would not have missed this opportunity to rock out for our Snowball families. I'm grateful that he is doing so much for all of us and he doesn't forget us.